I mean, I think in a sense that, you know, evolutionarily, it, it's not a it's not a a linear thing necessarily, but it's like you know first neurotransmitters had to be evolved, and they were sort of just out there, and mediating God knows what kind of relationships. But but then once you got primates are these big brain primates with these complex nervous systems, a lot of these neurotransmitters that occurred in plants, you know, became internalized and adapted you know to brain functions and uh, it's almost as though uh, you know Gaia needed somebody to you know talk to in, a, in in the simplest sense in and I think that's the function of these things is a communication between you know uh, the, the sentience that resides in nature and us, you know, who are part of nature, but in some, but a lot of times don't think of ourselves as part of nature, and we have this sense of a separateness from nature. And I think that's part of the, the lesson that psychedelics generally and DMT especially teaches us is that we're not really part of nature, and we're not really separate from nature. We're a part of this mix, you know, and it's just a kind of an arrogance on our part that makes us think we're somehow different.